Hello everyone. <clears throat> Hope you're all doing well. Well, it's late in the evening. It's actually past midnight and I was just about to call it a night that I thought I'd perhaps share with you a short discussion. <laughs> and hopefully this would be another helpful point uh, for you to ponder on your way to bigger and better things after your breakup on your journey of moving on. I know everyone who's going through a breakup has got lots of questions, lots of uh, feeling of devastation and so on and so forth. And we've discussed this on many of the videos that we have, many of the 2000 videos that we have on this channel. As you know, we have a site mindthatseekstruth.com and if you can't find your answers over um, in the 2000 videos that we have on this channel, when you search it on the search engine of my channel, you can go on my site and perhaps you wish to make a um, Skype uh, talk appointment with me and we'll discuss what's concerning you um, beyond the videos or the live talks that we have which are all free and we'll discuss it one-on-one -on, -one on um, Skype together. And I'll be more than happy to explore it with you. But here we are tonight just about one new point that I want you to consider. When you are going through this whole emotion of uh, breakup and so on and figuring out why and this and the so forth, why you're devastated and so on. Many of the reasons that we discussed are all there for you to discover. But think about it. One of the reasons that you feel so devastated is not because your partner, she or he, was exactly what you were looking for and you're so devastated because she left you. We talk about one kind of relationship and you see oh, how much of it is suitable to your kind of relationship. So when she's left you, you're thinking, oh, you know, you miss her and you want her, nobody better than her, and you want her back and you don't know what to do. And you come up with all these wonderful uh, memories and then, of course, you regret and so many questions. And you wonder why you feel the way you do. And you have all the reasons for you to figure out and convince yourself that these are the reasons why she was the best. Why, therefore, you miss her so much? Why, therefore, you're so devastated? Why, therefore, you should have her back in order to feel whole and balance again? But among many reasons that we discuss why you feel the way you do and how you should move on, which you can find on this channel, one thing you should focus on is not because she was all that great. Because if it was all perfect match, it wouldn't break up. You would still be together. So if it has broken up, it's not because she was the perfect match for you. So why are you missing her? Why do you feel devastated? It's because we all like to be loved. We all loved to be liked. And the most recent person with whom you had a relationship that she showed you affection and love and care and attention, it represents to you the like and the positive emotions and the love that we all wish to be extended toward us from the woman that we want to be with. And the most recent relationship, most recent woman, is the only one that seems real and actual to you. So, beside the relationship that just broke up, there is no other woman that comes to your mind, making you think that somebody other than the one that you just broke up with, or she broke up with you, could ever love you. Because we always revert back to the most recent relationship, therefore the most recent girl that you were with, and you think that's the only relationship that could ever be possible. 
Why? Because there are no other relationships in line waiting for you and attracting your attention and saying, hey, I'm here, don't worry, there's five other girls are waiting for you. Therefore, the only one that you have in your memory as an actuality is the, only, is the previous one, is the one that you just spoke up with. And since there's nothing else in the works, you think there'll never be another one. And because you really want to be liked and loved, you see, well, there is no other chance and there is no possibility to be loved again. But this one that I was with loved me, liked me. Why? Because I was with her. Therefore, you feel, oh, I miss the only woman that could ever love me. I miss the only woman that could ever like me. I miss the only chance that was available to you. Because you can't see what else is in the future, and you can't wait until that actually presents itself, you think because you can't see it, therefore there will never be. Because you can't see it, therefore there isn't. Because you can't see it and you don't know if it will, therefore it will never be. Because you're only ready to accept and believe something that you've had the experience with and you actually in actuality know that it was real. And the only thing real to you right now is the one that broke up because there's nothing else after the breakup. So you wonder, will there ever be another woman that will love you, that would like you? And that's why you feel so devastated because we all like to be liked and loved. And so you're worried about that. Therefore, you think that woman that you were with and is now broken up with you was the only and was the best and so on and so forth. However, just like everything else changes in this world, just like before you got involved with this relationship, you didn't know that you will get to know this girl. You also don't know that you will get to know another girl. <laughs> Just be patient. Let the nature take its course. Let life unfold itself. And before you know it, you will see that there is another one. Just like this previous one was another one after the one that you had already broken up. So just like this one was the second one after the one that you had broken up previous to this one, there will be another one that will replace the one that you just broke up. In other words, just be patient. Let the nature take its course and let life unfold itself. And before you decide and go to, you know, to the judgment of or uh, conclusion of there will never be another one who will love me or like me as much as this one did because you have all these memories and all these memories and uh, experiences are the actuality for you. Just wait and see. And before you know it, you will see, ah, good thing I waited because lo and behold, there is another relationship. There is another woman. And this is paying attention to me. And this is actuality. Therefore, that wasn't the only woman who would ever love me or like me. There are other ones in the works for all of us. So, lo and behold, be patient, go through life, enjoy every day, focus on building your life and building whatever it is you want to accomplish. And before you know it, you will come to the conclusion that we are discussing it tonight. I hope that would be something for you to ponder, and I'll talk to you soon.